president uh, of uh, Habib Bank, uh, Risha Badi Lukman, chairperson, of course. Um, it is really a, uh, I mean, as you all know, uh, the markets, the economy is going through a tough period, and it's really important. And we believe within PSX that within our own sphere of influence, we have to keep doing whatever we can. Uh, you know, sometimes when you look at the overall macro stuff, you look at what's going on, sometimes a natural human reaction, we just freeze. You know, But I think we have to keep doing, and if all of us do whatever we can in our own sphere of influence, inshallah, that will help to change the macro as well. And that is what I'm so happy to uh, be having this launch because this is, this is a uh, tremendous new product and a tremendous step forward in the uh, capital markets of uh, Pakistan. So welcome again. And uh, I know when uh, Aurangzeb, you were here last, uh, we, we had made a request that this is a product that we would love to work with you on. And uh, you know, uh, your, your team really worked hard at it. It wasn't an easy product. Um, you know, required various uh, changes to be made everywhere from State Bank to SECP to PSX, etc. But we all persevered and we've done it. And today it is uh, still a nascent product, but as Raida said, it is by far the largest ETF. It's the newest ETF, it's the seventh ETF, but it is by far in terms of its uh, AUMs the largest. And uh, soon, I know Mir has. Uh, great plans for it. It should become the first unicorn breaking through the billion uh, rupee AUMs and going well towards multiple billions. The, um, and and the, because, you know, it is, it is an ideal product. It's a, uh, in, especially in the current environment, before investing in treasury products, treasury markets, for smaller investors particularly, it was quite cumbersome. And the cost and the charges and all were also, you know, become quite prohibitive for smaller uh, transactions. But now with the, with a single trade, with a single phone call through your broker, you can buy and sell a diversified basket of government securities as easily as a, as a share. And uh, so really this is part of our and mutual funds industry's efforts to provide a low range, a low cost range of ETFs for investors. So they can invest in different strategies, and we have Islamic ETF right now. We have ETFs that are focused just on the consumer story. There are ETFs being worked on that will follow, that will track the you know tech uh, shares that are listed. So it becomes uh, once we have a pool of ETFs with different strategies, you know this is something which inevitably will take off. It is still very small part of the market, but it's it's the largest uh, probably um, asset category in the world worth about. Eight nine trillion dollars now, and there are now more ETFs, for example, listed on NYSC than shares. <laughs> you know, so it just shows. Uh, in India, when we looked at this industry, it took about eight years for it to take off, and now again, the amount of trading, the AUMs and ETFs, is are of you know uh, tremendous compared to all other uh, categories. So this has really fulfilled an important investment gap uh, in in the market. As, as Raida mentioned, this was officially launched in September 2022. Um, but uh, you know, I'm glad that we are having the, the uh, ceremony uh, uh, today. And we've also it, it has also added a uh, full um, you know index to our suite of indices that uh, that we have at PSX. And this is the first really proper benchmarked uh, fixed income uh, index. Um, you know, the other advantage of ETFs is that one of the issues we have in our capital markets is the low penetration. There is still a very small investor base. And again, if asset management companies, brokers market this well, this can really help to expand the investor base uh, in, in Pakistan. And you know, that has huge implications, not just for savings, investments, for wealth inequality, all kinds of things uh, that capital markets have to become, uh, become broader. And there are three things that I think we need to do to really make ETFs more successful. One, I would ask, and Meera, I would urge you to use the muscle of HBL AMC to make sure that your brokers, because we do that, we have constant webinars, training sessions for, for brokers uh, in PSX, that they understand what ETFs are, so that when someone calls them, they don't say, ETF chode, aap lucky cement ICI lene. Because they're two completely different uh, products. So please use your muscle to push your brokers 
uh, to uh, understand and market ETFs properly because it's a hugely attractive product for investors. It's low cost for AMCs. Look at uh, AMCs like BlackRock, Vanguard, who embraced ETFs and where they are today, and someone like Templeton, who didn't embrace ETFs and you know where they are today. So let's not be afraid of cannibalization. Let's really push this product. Second, the AMCs, you know, your again request that your sales compensation should be aligned for your sales teams to sell ETFs um, because it is a product which is good for the investors. And the third opportunity for brokers is obviously right now only HBL Treasury is doing market making, but that's another. Uh, for me today, um, it is exactly 25 years, February 1998, when I first walked into this, well, Today it's an auditorium. It's uh, at that point in time, this was where all the action was. Um, I requested the guy, the guard, to let me in. There were only two sort of people people allowed here: the green coats, which were the agents, and the red coats, which were the officials. So once you entered, ye boots nahi hote the. Ap aate the. There was a ring over here, and PTC ka patla chalta tha. And the other heavily traded stock was on the right side, which was Hubco. There were a couple of other stocks. I think it was uh, Thun Fiber or PSO. And that's about it. Between 98 and 2023, what's happened is new things have been created, innovation, in terms of the SACRA account, in terms of the privatization of the bank, in terms of the deregulation of the ENP sector, the new stocks coming in, PPL, OGDC. So what we need to look and think about is what we can create, what new products we can create, introduce into this market, because that's the only way forward. If we keep on thinking about the old ways and how things are done, ways, we will never be able to move forward. The Ready Futures market created that leverage part the, the new innovative MTS or the badla market, which was before the badla, we recreated it. So the only way forward is creating new products and creating new innovative products. We don't need to reinvent the wheel. We see what's happened in the West. As you said, ETFs is an extremely successful part over there. And we're very proud of it from HBL's part to be the first to, you know, to launch the debt ETF. Going forward, we're coming up with a lot of new innovative products, which the PSs is helping us out in. Um, Buddy Saab there as our uh, trustee and partner and custodial is pushing his team to think big, to think innovatively and helping us out. The regulator, SEC, Khalda is not here today, but she, you know, she's been a great uh, support in uh, allowing us to launch this product and helping us out with a lot of other new products that we are creating. Um, at HBL, we're looking to create alternative assets class, you know, besides the regular equities, fixed income, alternative assets. That's the way forward. So innovation is the way forward, technology is the way forward, and we at HBL believe in this. And our sponsor is very supportive of this in helping us to create these new things and moving towards a new market. Once, I thank, once again, I thank you all for being here. 20 years, and uh, very, very nostalgic and very, very emotional feeling when I got here today. But again, with this ETF, I just took two minutes from Raida because uh, there were some people who had worked extra, extra, extra hard on this. This was the first Treasury ETF of Pakistan. Regulations be in place, and uh, organizations may be a structured tariqa nahi tha jisse kaam hona tha in cheezon pe. So there are few people, starting with our partners, HBL Bank, of course, Faizan Ahmed from Treasury has done extraordinary work on this. So thank you very much, Faizan, for all your efforts. Uh, on the NCCPL side, Lukman Sahib, Asir Sahib has been very kind. We have called him in the morning, in the evening, and in the evening, and in the evening, when we launched the day. So, uh, Asir Sahib, thank you so much for your efforts. And uh, on the CDC side, RF, Kiran, Badi Sahib, we have done a lot of work. We have done a lot of work. We have done a lot of work. With this, uh Hearing what Meer Adil said and what Nofal said and talking and reminiscing about the older times, I would like to just make a point here that we are no doubt resilient as a country, as, uh, as country men and as a nation. We're hopeful because we're still at it every day. We wake up and we do our little bit to make a difference in this country.
country. So wishing the best for everybody, for the ETF, for the capital markets, for the banking sector as well, and overall finance and economy of the country. Uh, I, with this, uh, I, we, I would like to conclude uh, today's uh, program. Hassan Raza from PSX. Alhamdulillah, ye, we are very pleased that this launch was in conjunction with uh, PSX. Look, HBL has always been trying to bring an innovation, lai, mein mein, whether it's agriculture, whether it's SME, and now today launching this product with PSX. Look, this is a fixed income ETF. And the asset classes will come in, it will be cash, hoga, short term treasury bill, and uh, PIBs. Hongi. तो उनको मिला के इसकी ड्यूरेशन 4 साल से ज्यादा नहीं होगी लेकिन ये एक डेट सिक्योरिटी है जो लिस्टेड है और स्टॉक एक्सचेंज पे अवेलेबल है और ये अब अगर इसको सही तरह मार्केट किया जाए इसकी जो इन्वेस्टर्स को यील्ड मिलेगी वो बहुत मुनासिब मिलेगी इनफैक्ट इट कैन बी इवन बेटर देन मनी मार्केट फंड्स तो ये आप समझ लें कि इन्वेस्टर्स के लिए एक और एवेन्यू उनको मिल गया है व्हिच इज फेयरली सिक्योर इट्स ऑन द डेट साइड जिसमें वो इन्वेस्ट कर सकते हैं और इसको आगे लेकर जा सकते हैं बहुत शुक्रिया I think it's a very critical, uh, critical question and this uh, product ko launch karne ka maksad hi ye tha ki government securities, T-bills, PIBs aam aadmi ki pahunch mein aa jaye. Jaise hum koi bhi share kareete hain stock market mein jaake. This uh, product can be bought through any broker in the stock market and sold at any time. Its liquidity and market making is available all times. What does it benefit from Pakistan? What does it benefit from our economy? How does it benefit from the economy? How does it benefit from the capital markets? And those who don't want to invest in shares, they want to go to banks and want to make a fixed income. In the stock market, they can avail this product through their fixed income. My name is Anisho Rahim, I am in HBL Asset Management, I am head of CX, I have products and customer experience. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I am very excited. 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 In itself, it was a very big innovation in our market. In the whole market, there are ETFs in the whole market, PSX. So, we have worked with SCP with SCP, and we have launched it with asset management companies. Because there are a lot of small investors in it, and there is a lot of advantage. So, every ETF follows a different strategy. So, if someone wants to take for example, consumer stocks, then it will be looked at which 5-6 stocks or 10 stocks that the consumer डिमांड के ऊपर ज़्यादा अच्छा ग्रो करते हैं, वो सिर्फ एक ट्रेड से एक ईटीएफ खरीद सकता है, जो के बहुत लो कॉस्ट होता है, और उसको उन दस स्टॉक्स के ऊपर एक साथ एक्सपोज़र मिल जाएगा। इसी तरह आज जो ईटीएफ लॉन्च हुआ है हबीब बैंक का फिक्स्ड इनकम का, अब आपको पता है आजकल � एक गवर्नमेंट सिक्योरिटी चाहे ट्रेजरी बिल होए पीआईबीज होए उनके ऊपर वो एक्सपोज़र ले सकते हैं उनमें इन्वेस्ट कर सकते हैं इतनी आसानी से जितनी आसानी से वो शेयर्स में इन्वेस्ट कर सकते हैं और जब उनको बेचना होए अपने ब्रोकर को कॉल किया और उसको कहा बेच दो 
और ये फिक्स्ड इनकम है क्योंकि तो उनकी इनकी वैल्यू जिस तरह जिस तरह इंटरेस्ट रेट्स बिहेव करते हैं उसी तरह ये भी बिहेव करते हैं और आपको उतना ही जो है वो इंटरेस्ट रेट इस पर मिल जाएगा तो ये बहुत आसानी हो जाती है इन्वेस्टर्स के लिए कि बजाय पैसा निकालें फिर बैंक में जाएँ बैंक के डिपॉजिट रेट्स भी कम होते हैं तो आपको जो फुल जो गवर्नमेंट ट्रेजरी बिल्स का रेट है वो यहाँ पर आपको मिल जाएगा तो मेरे ख्याल में ये माशा बहुत ही अच्छा प्रोडक्ट है और आई होप के ब्रोकर्स और इन्वेस्टर्स इससे फ़ायदा उठा सकेंगे शुक्रिया बहुत